Attention employees who have recently been in contact with Authorization. Major Nichayev. Co to the medical center for an urgent checkup. I know you're here, Petrov. You've got nowhere to run. I'll give you ten seconds to surrender. According to biometric readings, this is Petrov. It is? Crispy critters. Shit. It really is Petrov. Ah, I had a feeling it'd end this way. Wizard, this is P3. Come in. Wizard here. Have you found Petrov, my boy? I found his body. He's been decapitated. A loader turned his skull into blood pudding. Damn. His head contained codes I would have used to end this nightmare quickly. I'm sorry, Dr. Sechenov. I was too late. <sighs> then we'll have to solve the problem another way. Did he have any rings on him? 
Two gold rings? Uh, no rings, sir. Just a candle. Understood. I need you to report to the VDNH at once, B3. We've got bigger problems than Petrov to deal with. What could be worse than Petrov? Stockhausen will debrief you at the VDNH. Hurry. Time is of the essence. Do I make myself clear, my boy? 10-4, wizard. Moving out. from the candles isn't sufficient to power the main gate, but installing them activated a system that provides special polymers to the birch tree life support system. The life support system has four primary functions. Maintaining optimal temperature, eliminating insects. In other words, four columns, four canisters. Charles, I'm in the hot shop. Am I gonna turn into a crispy critter if I stay in here too long? No, the laboratory tables in the hot workshop or thermarium require high temperatures, but the temperature within the shop itself is quite comfortable. Fading data. So, what do you... About our birch tree, sugar. The one in the humongous glass thing? What about it? She's holding out for a hero, just like I do. Waiting for someone to save her from the biting cold. Oh, that's it. Enough. One deranged tin can is plenty for me. I knew you would stay loyal to me, handsome. Take off the glove, and we'll be together forever. Don't hold your breath. So... Why is this birch tree so important? It's not important at all, Stutt. You'll have to warm her up, but you can ignore her. She's a dumb tree. Nothing like me. Crispy critters. At least the tree doesn't talk. You would be... Shit. Where did all these monsters come from? A clear hypothesis, but I suspect they're the bodies of dead soldiers that have been infected by sprouts. A fucking hypothesis? Are you shitting me?
freaking critters. This place just keeps getting more and more fucked up. Sons of bitches. Lost it. Fuck my life. This is usually a harmless geodesic geology robot. <laughs> harmless, my ass. What other tricks does it have up its sleeve? I'm not sure. I don't have access to this model's data. I wish it didn't have access to us. I couldn't agree more, Comrade Major. Come on, let's go find that canister. At least we won't have to find the door to the shop. We can just climb... Authorization. Major... Select the desired procedure. think the canister might be a device that dispenses the luminescent polymer is located on one of these platforms 
Let's go find it. There's no canister here. I'm sure we can find one here somewhere. We found the dispenser. Now we gotta find a goddamn canister. How do you like that? Judging from its shape and diameter, indeed. Great. I'll come back later. The massive mixers that enrich raw polymer with anaerobic bacteria operate at a set speed. So if the speed is increased, the process will get sped up too? Where's the control panel? There isn't one. Under normal circumstances, the speed of the problem. circumstances, the speed of the process does not vary, but a shock blast could provide their electric motors with extra... Please select the desired procedure. Yeah, there we go. Did you know there was a cable car here? I assume there must be a way to service the equipment hanging from the ceiling. Gotta be careful. It's a long way down. I could get hurt. Hurt? You're an optimist. That's my thing, Chucky. Canister will be filled in 20 days. It worked. Look at that pool glow. It's actually kind of pretty. Please note that your unscheduled maintenance has initiated the repair algorithm.
why can't this lousy goddamn cable car go any faster? No one foresaw this particular turn of events. It was a rhetorical question, Chuck. Just need to speed up the last motor. No, at least I don't have to worry about ammo. Pleasant lights all around, Shayla's buzzing in the distance. How romantic. Blazing isn't always the best approach, Major. Sure, sometimes you can try upgrading your gear or find another way to keep the bots at bay. You can collect the canister now. Comrade Major? Yes? Got something constructive to say? Have I done something to offend you? Why are you taking your frustration out on me? <sighs> Sorry. It's not your fault. I'm just mad at myself. Why? You didn't kill Petrov. 
He was killed by his own weapon, a hostile robot. That doesn't matter. I was supposed to take him alive, and I failed. And that's not all. Sechenov saved my life. He's like a father to me. As far as I can remember, anyway, I let him down. If that's what's troubling you, just let it go. There's nothing unusual about your situation. What do you mean? Isn't it obvious? Comrade Sechenov is always disappointed in everyone. There's no pleasing the man. His perfectionism is pathological, and everyone knows it. Every single person in his life lets him down. What? No, that's bullshit. Neuropolymer gloves are incapable of deception. Uh, yeah, I guess so. Look like they're about to blow. What the hell are we I've seen that stuff before? It's cryogenic, right? Indeed, it is. That is a Fahrenheit, a candle filled with cryopolymer. It's designed to reduce temperatures and equalize pressure in high temperature furnaces. I'll try getting them into the boilers. How do I get into the pipe? Found the opening. Mm. Uh, what do I do now? Lug this shit to the boiler myself? The boiler's too hot to touch. I need to find a way to cool it off from the inside.
Sure. It's a good thing the pipes openings in the next room and not over by the birch tree. All set. Who the hell came up with all this shit? I'm sick to death of shoving balls into tubes. We're doing this so we can leave the Vavilov complex. Why can't I just, I don't know... Walk out a regular door. I'm afraid only an irregular door is available. Have you found Dr. Filatova yet? The one who helped Petrov butcher hundreds of people? No. She's still crawling around somewhere. I emphasize that Dr. Filatova must not be hurt. If her life is threatened, you must come to her defense. What? Rescue the bitch whose fault it is I'm wading knee-deep in gore? What the fuck? Traitor Petrov used Dr. Filatova without her knowledge. She had no inkling of his true intentions. I mean the viciousness of his homicidal maniac. Her guilt must be established by a court of law. <laughs> Too good for her. She deserves no less. Dr. Filatova is a renowned neural surgeon. 
Dr. Sechenov entrusted her with a collective research that connected both humans and robots. She must not be hurt. Did I make myself clear, Comrade Major? I'll keep it in mind. Authorization. Major Nichayev. What's the hot workshop used for? Heat-resistant polymers are made here. But most of the research is dedicated to the cultivation of heat-resistant flora. Nice. The polymers here are enriched with essential oils from Cacticae cereris, a cactus. The polymers make it possible to cultivate groups of plants that are adapted to high temperatures. Do they want to make the desert greener or something? Something like that. They plan to terraform Mars. Canisters fill automatically once the temperature is normalized. Oi, 
What's that supposed to mean? It's hot. Everything here seems pretty cut and dry. We should head back before something fucked up happens. What do we know about Petrov's girlfriend, Charles? Are you referring to Dr. Filatova? That's what I said. Did the cat get your tongue? Do you know her? Dr. Larissa Filatova, MD, has worked with Dr. Sechenov for many years. She's a talented neurosurgeon and was Comrade Zaharov's student and assistant. She continued the professor's work after he died. But she is now a criminal and a traitor to the motherland. Understood. It's too bad. She's kind of cute. Fading data. 